Workout number 18 is going to be as tough on your mental strength as it is your physical strength. It's an e month, so every minute on the minute until failure. We're doing one burpee, one lunge jump, one sit up. Every round, you add one rep. So for round two, it'll be two burpees, then two lunge jumps, then two sit ups. Round three, you'll do three burpees first, then your three lunge jumps, then your three sit ups, and you keep going with that until you can't fit all three exercises in in the minute. So you might we'll just say get the eight burpees done, eight lunge jumps, maybe five sit ups, and then the whistle goes, your minute is over. That's that part of the workout finished for you. So every minute on the minute, just um, is your EMOM and if it takes you, we'll say for example 10 seconds or so to get the first round done, so one burpee, one lunge jump, one sit up, that means you 50 second rest. Obviously as the rounds go on, the reps get higher, your rest is going to decrease. That's where the mental toughness will come into it and you're just going to try, try your best to get through um, as many reps and as many rounds in this one as you can. Just dig deep. Pick up your pace as the rounds go on, so maybe start off a nice gentle pace, then pick it up as the rounds go on to try and get some rest period in. Um, it will end up that you'll be like, you might have any rest early in between the last round, and um, the second last round, or maybe the last three rounds, because you'll just be pushing hard to get it out. Your workout is over there. So when you're finished, or when you've capped out on your EMOM, take one minute rest. Then you're going to be straight into two to three rounds of one minute max push-ups. You'll rest for a minute, one minute squat jumps, rest for a minute, one minute leg lowers, and rest for a minute. Then back to the start for push-ups, squat jumps, leg lowers, and if you want the third round to get it in as well, that's okay. Max push-ups or max reps on any of these, we're looking for full range of movement and good quality reps. We're going to be tired, you're going pretty much straight from one workout straight into the next. So it's going to be quite challenging. You're not going to want to do it. You're going to be feeling sorry for yourself after pushing really hard here. So don't save yourself at all. Push really hard for the first part. Give it everything you have then for the next two and three rounds. Good reps, especially on your push-ups, your squat jumps. We're getting full depth. On your leg lowers, make sure that back is staying low to the ground all the time. If you need to scale it back, doing single leg lowers or leg extensions, maybe not bringing the heels as close to the ground. The lower you bring them, the more demanding it will be on your core. Um, so if you're limited a little bit in your core strength there, just don't go as low. Um, that is it, scale versions will be up as well. Um, complete body weight workout. Give it your best shot. Again guys, let me know how you're getting on. Maybe post some scores, a little clip of you doing the workout on Instagram or whatever it is. And let us know how we get on.